What's up everybody, I hope you're having a great time. Today I'm going to be reviewing the second book of the Chaos Walking trilogy. The first book was Chaos Walking and the Knife of Never Letting Go and today let's dive into Chaos Walking, The Ask and the Answer. What I really enjoy about this book is that it gives us a very vivid example of terrorism. This book is literally all about terrorism. The ask and the answer are terrorist groups' names. I'm not going to spoil this book, but to give a general idea, I'm going to read the back of the book. Fleeing before a relentless army, Todd and Viola once again face their worst enemy, Mayor Prentice. Immediately imprisoned and separated from Viola, Todd is forced to learn the ways of the mayor's new order. And then one day, the bombs begin to explode. Now you might be wondering, who is Viola? Now, in the previous book, I didn't spoil this, but Viola is actually another character that is introduced in the previous book, The Knife of Never Letting Go, and Todd meets and teams up with her. As you can see from this example is that Todd is yet again faced with troubles. Now in my opinion, this is the best book out of the three books in the trilogy. This is because it shows real character development in human and alien. And I also like it because there's a lot of action and a teensy bit of drama here and there. And I have to say, the style this book was written in, I read this book twice and I loved it the second time as well. I'm going to be rating this book a 5 out of a 5. Don't forget to go hit that subscribe button, smash the notification bell, and drop a like please. This book was written by Patrick Ness. I've mentioned a few of his other books that I've read in my previous video, so please make sure to go check that out. Link's gonna be in the description. Fact of the day is that dead bodies can get goosebumps. Hey, you wanna buy a watch?